In order to open the account with Interactive Brokers, click Open Account in the upper right corner and choose Trader or Investor. After that, click Start Application in Individual Accounts section. Here you need to insert your email address And after that, create your user ID, which you are going to use in the future, and your password. You can see the password requirements below. Confirm password. After that, you're choosing your legal residence, the country where you live. I'm going to choose Greece and click Continue. You're going to receive a verification email, so go to your email box, open the email from Interactive Brokers and click on Verify Account. You'll be transferred back to Interactive Brokers website where you would have to insert your username and the password to login. So here you need to fill in your personal information. First and last name are required. Your date of birth, you can choose it from the drop down menu. adjust. Gender, marital status, and the number of dependents. Choose zero if you have none. Next, the address. Remember that you would have to confirm your address later on, so put the real one, which you can confirm. Street, city, state, and the postal code. After that, you insert your whatever number you want to use. Landline, for example. You can add additional number if you want to. I don't. In the next section, you are required to insert your tax information, the country, and your tax number. And then the document of your identity. Let's say national identity card, and of course, its number. Then you would have to choose your employment type. You obviously won't be employed, unemployed, I'm sorry, because later on you would have to insert your income amount. I'm going to choose self-employed and the name of employer is my own. So, choose the nature of your business, the general field of it. Occupation. Then address of your employer, again, my own street address. Exactly the same as I inserted before, the country from drop-down list, street. C, 
City. State. And the postal code. And then you have to choose type of account, choose margin. Now, here we have three security questions. They are required in case you forget your password and you will be asked to answer these questions in order to change a password in the future. There's a really wide range of questions, so choose those that you can remember easiest. Okay, done with questions and answers. Continue. Regulatory information. I leave no in both questions, since it's true. Now, here's the income category I was talking about a few minutes ago. I choose range from 100,000 to 199,000 euros. Liquid net worth the same annual net income from 100,000 till 250 and investment objectives let's say growth hedging and trading profits now as an experienced trader myself I choose over 10 years of trading with more than 100 trades per year and extensive knowledge level. Then choose the product, Forex in my example, and repeat the information above about experience in a trading with the particular product. Then you can choose your trading countries. I'm going to choose all in each continent. OK, let's continue. Now, W8 form. In this page, uh, an individual must declare that one is not living nor taxed in the United States of America. If it's true, scroll down the page, check your personal information, which is filled up automatically. Now, in the part two, you declare what country is your legal residence in. Part three, click yes on two buttons to agree. Okay. And again, I agree at the end of the page. General agreements and disclosures. 
obviously I agree with everything. Right. Signature and general consent and click continue. Now, you can transfer your funds later on. Let's finish with the account application for now. So click skip. Now, here you you're asked to provide some copies of your documents to prove your ID and address. Click Upload. I choose the type of document I, I declared earlier. Choose the file. As you can see, it's different for the front and back. So make sure you have both sides. Okay, upload. Close. And the same for the proof of address. Choose the type of document you want to upload. There is a drop down menu with acceptable documents. utility bill for example and again two files for back and front upload complete close okay continue now market data subscriber status Choose non-professional. Because this is the true, otherwise you wouldn't be watching this video. Again, agree with everything and continue. Non-professional market data subscriptions. Well, leave it as it is, as well as quote booster and continue. Here you just agree with everything that is asked. Signature again and continue. In this page you can optionally select an additional secure login system from the options available or if you don't want to click continue. Application status pending. Within two business days, all the information you provided will be processed by interactive brokers and after you will receive an email with notification that your account has been opened. Good luck with opening your own account and future trading.